The black books provide a unique window into the creative process of a major psychologist, showing how Jung became Jung. They chart his attempt to resolve the 20th century crisis of meaning in his own person, and distill from this a means in psychotherapy which would enable others to do likewise. Together with the red book, they form the esoteric core of analytical psychology and enable its historical genesis to be studied. The material up to 1916 illuminates the genesis of the Red Book. The material from 1916 charts his evolving understanding and demonstrate how he sought to develop and embody the insights he'd gained in his life, such as in the triangular relations with Emma Jung and Tony Wolff. The Black Books enable his paintings from 1916 onwards to be understood in the context of the evolution of his personal cosmology. Thus, the black books enable the reader to enter the private laboratory of analytical psychology and follow the genesis of a visionary science, that is, how a psychology was born of the visionary imagination, which in turn could form a science of visions.